Yo, yo, Daily Fire. If it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com. For all your supplement needs, go to Max Effort Muscle. All right, Daily Fire. Today, we're going to talk about they all everything affects each other. So when you don't have things in line, it's hard to really get things popping. And let me explain to you. So when my diet is in line, when my training is in line, when my development is in line, then the rest of my life is in line. Meaning that I can make crisp decisions. I can take calculated risks. Um, I feel confident in the things that I'm after and what I'm doing. It's one of those things where the discipline is not always in line the way you want it to, but you want to fight for that. Because when you can get one thing in line, then the next thing gets in line. And then the next thing gets in line. So then it's like, all right, I'm about my meal prep. Because I'm about my meal prep, I got my supplements on lock. Because I got my training on lock, I got my GPP, which is my lunges on lock. Because my lunges are on lock and I got goals to make my body better, I'm gonna start the learning process. So now I got my mind on lock. And then I walk into work and damn, I'm a little bit more confident. And then I'm, it's time for that promotion and I gotta present to my boss and I fucking blaze it. You know why I blaze it? Because I expect to blaze it. Because everything's in line. And then I might get me a lob pass on a Nerf hoop because I've been working so hard. Yo, there's the lob pass. Take that bitch and dunk it, right? Sometimes I'd rather be lucky than good. But the reality is when you work really hard, that luck comes your way. I would argue that nothing is lucky, is that you force the luck. And at the end of the day, if you're optimistically out here getting it, you got a better shot to be successful. So once again, think about your dominoes. How can you put them in line so you can get this process going? It doesn't always feel this way. I'm always fighting for that. You don't always feel smooth. Some things are out of balance, but guess what? If they're just out of balance a little bit, you still got opportunities to try to get a chance to be great. So they all affect each other. So I know when I'm not about my business with my diet, that I'm not going to feel as good in the gym. I'm not going to look as good. My marketing's not going to be as crispy. My brain's not going to be as crispy. I know when I'm not developing myself with the lunge and learn, or I'm not fighting to learn new material, or I'm not pushing myself with the date on the calendar, I know my results overall are going to be less than. It's just what it is. So I know that mine ties back to fitness because this is what I do. But I'm telling you, yours does too. Because when you take care of yourself physically and mentally. Your relationships are better. Your work, your success is going to be better. Your optimism about the world is going to feel better. So don't be okay and don't get used to feeling shitty. Push to be addicted to feel better and take care of yourself because when these dominoes are lined up, they will fall more how you want them to. Daily Fire. Share it out for me. Appreciate y'all. Peace.